User Management for the Web Studio, EMR Manager and Vepris. The EMR Manager, Vepris and the Web Studio can only be used by registered users who have the appropriate access rights. New users must first apply for an account with your responsible contact person. If you are already logged in as a user, you can change your user data via the User Management section. To do this, click on the question mark icon in the title bar, and select Change My Account. After entering your password and clicking on OK, the User Management section will open. Here, you can change your password and change or add to your personal data or details. In the password field, you now have two options. You can use the magic wand to set a password, which you will then receive by email. Or you can assign a password. Here, you should be mindful of the following. The password must be at least 8 characters long, and contain at least one upper and one lower case letter, one number and one special character. In addition, usernames or parts thereof may not be included in the password. Additional data can be added under Details. In addition, you can set your preferences here as to whether you want to receive an email when your account is changed or deleted. If the maintenance function is active, you will be informed by email when, for example, maintenance work or a system restart is to be planned by your system administrator and distributed by email. At the bottom edge, you will see who created the profile or made the last change. You can find out the user management version number via the question mark. Click on the arrow to return to the main page. Click on the OK button to save the changed data. To exit user management, click on the close icon in the title bar. If the EMR manager is not available on your station, you can start user management by double clicking on the user management desktop icon. Enter your user data here. If a user is logged in that does not belong to the group of key users or administrators, he can only change his own data in this window, as already shown above.